What's Cracker Like in YouTube? It's Friendly Neighborhood Ball of Chaos, Absolute Destruction here, and I am bringing you our week three battle for the NPCC, and we are going against uh, my buddy Uzi. His team name is, and this will be all explained in the, if you didn't watch the team preview, go, ch go check that out, but his team is called the Bullet Punch Club. It's a reference to, uh, the Bullet, uh, Bullet Club from Wrestling World, so if you don't get that, that's where it's from. So I'm really excited for the battle. This is the first time I'm doing a live recording of the battle, so this is going to be interesting to see how it goes. Um, compared to our last two battles, when we did postcom, we lost. We're currently 0-2, so we're hopefully, crossing fingers, able to pick up a victory for this one. I'm hoping. His team is very scary. Um... This team is very, very scary. He has some major big threats on his team. But, as you can see here, we're bringing the Raikou, the Salamence, the Enbor, the Roserade, the Deontay, and the Tapu Fini for his team. So, we'll see how well it goes. Like I said, if you have not watched the team preview, go watch that down below. The link will be in the description below. Um, let's get some music up in here. Um, come on. There we go. That's what I want. And let's turn the music on because the music's probably not on at all. All right, there we go. So the battle music will start. I didn't realize the volume was off on this one. <laughs> so we're trying to get this battle quickly because he has to. It's really late for him, and he has to get some sleep because he is leaving tomorrow for him. It's only like two thirty in the afternoon for me, but for him it's really late. Um. So he uh, has to get the battle done. He didn't bring the Espeon, but he did not bring the Thunderous. Holy crap, thank god. Okay, so now I can really Volt Switch whenever I want. That is awesome. I can Volt Switch, I can T-Bolt whenever I want. Um, that is awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Um, I feared he was going to bring the Espeon. Because um, the only hazards I have, I think I have spikes on Velvet Sky. Oh, communication with the team. Other trainer has occurred. Uh oh. Mm. Uh oh. I don't know who's trying to send me a trade request. <laughs> I'm still online. <laughs> uh, I don't know what happened there. I'm still online, but it doesn't say he is. So he might have lost internet connection. Yes, I can. I don't see you online anymore. It says you are offline. <laughs> Gotta love this live stuff when things go wrong. Um, because it says, like, I have him right here, but it says he's offline. So, I don't know. I can't click on his name. Like, I'm clicking on it, and that's why you hear that. Eh, 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 eh. But I don't know why you're saying that I can't battle anyone anymore, can you? And I was like, I can battle just fine. I've used this 3DS for my last two weeks, and didn't say anything about an update needed again. So I know this. I can battle with this 3DS. This is the battle I use for my streams and all that stuff. So I know that's not an issue. All right. So he's trying to sign back online again. Gotta love live issues that happen. Um, so, what I saw before, which I should probably write that down. Let me get a notepad up. Um, so can we go online? So I, we know he wrote Infernape. Infernape. 
Crobat, Tangrowth, Magiana, Espeon, and I forget what the last one was. There we go. Let's try this again. I don't know if he brought the Alamomola. Um, I know he didn't bring the Thunderous. Oh, uh, Tyrantrum. The fact that he didn't bring Alamomola was great for me because that was the biggest threat to just one of my biggest threats I had to deal with. Um, that core together is really, really broken. <laughs> um, so let's try this again. Decide for myself. Good thing, see, I'm, I'm okay with it happening before the battle starts, because once the battle starts, we had to recreate everything that happened. So, that would suck. Alright, pick up my music. Because it won't let me go past this screen when I select my battle team, if the team wasn't allowed. So, the t our teams are allowed. Please select participating Pokemon. So yeah, so it's Infernape, Crobat, Tangrowth, Magiana, Espeon, and Tyrantrum. So... We're good there. Um, now we just gotta decide what we want to lead with. Because he can easily lead with his Infernape to possibly get rocks up. Because that could be a lead rocks, uh, rocks one. Um, I mean, I'm just gonna lead with AJ Styles. A choice specs Volt Switch onto anything. I mean, if he goes into Tangrowth, that's fine. Because looking at it now, Tangrowth has to be his physical defensive mod, and Magiana has to be special defensive, special defensive, so... It's not that big of an issue. Um, so... I'm not too worried about it. So... Good luck, my dude. Good luck, good luck, good luck. So we're off with AJ Styles, our beautiful Raikou. This is the first time I actually think I'm actually bringing Raikou. Bro. This Tyrantrum. Okay, so he might be Choice Scarf Tyrantrum. I can see that being a thing. Um, I can definitely see that being a thing. Hmm. Let me see. Tyrant. Uh, Pokemon damage calculator. Okay, so. Let me copy this Raichu that I have. No, Raichu. Pfft. Raichu. Put it into here, and then Tyrantrum. So if he is, if he's rocking the earthquake, he can't. He has a chance to one-shot me here. Um. Hmm. My Volt Switch would do about thirty percent to him. So if he is Toy Scarf, that's an issue. Um, so why would he, why else would he lead with this thing? Um, I'm gonna Volt Switch, and hope he's not Twitch. Are you Head Smash? That's gonna hurt. He does take my Raikou. Okay, that's all unfortunate. He didn't bring the Alamomola, so I'm not too worried about it. He didn't bring Alamomola, so I'm not too worried about it. So I know he's, he's Toy Scarf. <laughs> He's Toy Star Head Smash. Um, so I can go into Victoria here because um, it's still going to do about 50%. Um, what about Tapu Fini? Still going to do a lot. Um, 
I can get an Intimidate off on it. If I go into Salamence. But even with an Intimidate drop, he's still going to... Um, still going to Oko me, so I can't go into that. Um, question is... Embor, who's faster? Um, so if he's max speed, because my Embor is 196 of 236, so if he's max speed, he outspeeds me, and Head Smash can still kill. But if I outspeed, I don't have superpower. Um, oh my, I need to make a move. Um, let's just go into Tapu Fini. It's choice scarf head smash. Like, I don't know what I can do against that. Um, that's really unfortunate. Like, I don't know what I can do against a choice scarf head smash. Without Ferrothorn here. Ferrothorn would be my best switch in for that, but I don't have it. So, I don't have Moonblast on this thing, because I took it off for Taunt, because someone told me to bring Taunt and, uh, for Magianna from setting up. So, I'm just going to Nature's Madness and hope for the best. Because... Oh, here, Witch Roof. Okay, that works. Cool. Awesome. That works. Goes on Luke Harper. This thing. Okay. I can at least get some Nature's Madness off on it. Um... I'm just going to taunt this thing, because I think I might outspeed it. I don't know if I, I do. So I can stop from setting up any Leech Seeds or anything like that. So. Here's for the knockoff. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. Um, he might be Regenerator. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to now switch into Velvet Sky here. I'm going to switch into Velvet Sky here. Because he's probably going to try to go for a grass type move. Go for a hidden power. Probably hidden power fire, I guess. That's fine. Um, I'm just going to sludge bomb here. I can't get a poison off, but I at least can do a lot of damage off on this thing. So if he wants to switch out, that's fine. Um, his best vision is probably Espeon, predicting me to possibly go for, like, spikes or toxic spikes. And then I can at least, I can then at least get some good damage off with this thing. Because a Life Orb Sludge Bomb should still do a lot to Espeon. Annabelle, so that's probably his Espeon. Yeah, that's fine. They did a lot of damage, okay. Um, hmm. I'm just going to go into my Tapu Fini now. Tapu Fini, Tapu Fini, Tapu Fini. I did lose my leftovers, which sucks, but I mean, there's not much I can really do about that. Because I can predict him to try to go for... Because the only reason why I'm going back in Type Fini is because if he wants to set up screens, I can at least default away the screens. Man, Toy Scarf freaking Tyrantrum. Ugh. That's so annoying. Because I don't think I outspeed. If, if he's max speed, I don't think I outspeed. So this is pretty good for me here. This is pretty good for me here. Because I'm just going to... I'm going to taunt this thing. Stop him from pretty much doing anything. Now that I reveal the taunt, he does withdraw it. So again, he can't least seed or anything. Which one for Nature's Madness there? Because I could have got a lot of damage off. I'm going to Nature's Madness now. If I have him to predict, uh, because I predict he'll probably go for a knockoff again. I think I was like, okay, he's going to switch out. He doesn't want to take a grass type move. He's going to switch out. So I'm going to stay in just to get a Nature's Madness off on this thing.
Goes for Hidden Power Fire. Good. Okay, cool. So, the question is... Will Surf kill at this point? Well, I know I outspeed. We've seen Knock Off and Hidden Power Fire on this thing. Um... I'm actually going to go into Neville here. Because if he wants to go for a uh, Grass-type move, that's fine. If he wants to go for a Fire-type move, that's fine. Either way. Get your hand. That's fine. Res double resist that. That's fine. Now, I'm pretty sure I should outspeed a Choice Scarf... Um, If I get a D-Dance up, I should outspeed a Choice Scarf Tyrantrum. Should. Should, 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 should. So I have max speed, I am generally always faster than him. If I can get a plus one off, that's fine. If we see Knock Off, Giga Drain, Hit and Power Fire, he might be Assault Vested. Um, and be rocking a fourth move. He does stay in. So the question is, what does he go for? He goes for a Rock Slide. Fuck you. <laughs> Hidden Power. It might be Hidden Power Ice. Fire Fire. Yeah, it's Hidden Power Ice. Um, that sucks for me, but I have a plus one off. So, let's see. Tangrowth. I'm assuming he's uh, Tangrowth. Assault Vested. Uh, that's what I'm assuming. Um, if I go into Salamence. Um... I get a plus one off. Um, Dragon Claw should kill. Dragon Claw should kill. So I'm just gonna go ahead and Dragon Claw. If it does withdraw. It goes into Brawn. Ooh! This thing's taking a plus one Dragon Claw to the face. Ow. Bye bye, Braun. Okay, so Salamence takes out Braun. Awesome, that is perfect for me. That is perfect, that is perfect, that is perfect. Um, so goodbye, Braun. Um, now, if I had the plus one from Moxie, we'd be good. But we don't. So, what I'm gonna do is. If I had Ground EMZ, which I originally wanted to put on here, this thing would definitely die. But I'm just gonna go for Earthquake. And just do as much damage to this thing as possible. If I take it out, great. I don't take it out. That's unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Goes for that thing. That's fine. I at least did a lot of damage to this thing. And I took out that brawn, which is head smashing me to another dimension. Um, I took that thing out, which is fine. It's fine, fine, fine. Because um, now with that Tyrantrum gone, I can go into Rusev. And Flare Blitz... Anything that wants to come in. Because nothing wants to eat a, a Flare Blitz from this thing. Infernape, maybe. But I have plenty of switch outs for Infernape, so that's not a problem. So I know I outspeed this thing because I'm Choice Scarf. I can just Flare Blitz. <laughs> you do another dimension. <laughs> you want to head smash me? I can head smash you right back. But I'm not. Actually, head smash wouldn't have been too bad. But Tank Growth will probably eat it up. So Tyrantrum is out took out uh one one against Raikou Salamence is one one so Magiata got one kill Salamence got one kill Tyrantrum got one kill Raikou, 0-1. Alright, so... He does withdraw. Annabelle. This thing is not living a, a Flare Blitz. <laughs> this thing's not living a Flare Blitz. He probably thinks I'm Choice Banded, though. He'll probably think I'm Choice Banded. 
Um, and I took very little damage from that, which is nice. Uh, he was in his own AJ Styles, which is in his Fernape. Okay. Um, question is... M more. Nope. Come on, you stupid thing. Um... That's what I want. Infernape. Flare Blitz does not kill. Um... If he has... Earthquake, it does not kill. So... I can go for a Flare Blitz here and be fine. Um, I have no reason not to. But I want to bluff out the Choice Scarf and want him to think that I'm rocking a Choice Band. So I'm going to switch into Mickey James here. I want him to think I'm rocking a Choice Band, not a Choice Scarf. Because that's what he's going to think. That's probably what he thinks. So if I can bluff that out when he goes into Crobat, I should outspeed the Crobat. Um, goes for a Sword Saint, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. So I'm just going to surf now. If he wants to switch out, that's fine. Is that a... Oh, it's pretty cool. He's going for Gunk Shot. He's going for the Gunk Shot. That's fine. He's going for the Poison MZ. That's fine. I might be able to live it. I am bulky. No, okay, so in front of him goes down. Well, not in front of him, Mickey James goes down. That's unfortunate, but that's fine. I'm not too worried about that. I am not too worried about that. Who's faster? Um. Hmm. Question is, what do I do here? Um. Infernape, and then. Roserade. He's definitely faster. Um, well, that's unfortunate. I sort of have to go into Rusev here and just go for a Choice Scarf. Uh, head Smash. Um, or Earthquake. Oh, god damn, I didn't want to do that. That's what I want. Um, hmm... Embor. An earthquake kills. An earthquake does kill, but with it's plenty of other monsters he has, I can't risk it. So I'm gonna have to go for head smash because I don't think um, my Deontay can live a hit from this thing. So I am special defensive on here. Running out of time. Just go into Embor. I, mean, I might have been able to live a hit, but I won't be able to do anything back. Yeah, I would have been able to live a hit, but I won't be able to do anything back to it. So. I'm just gonna head smash. If he wants to switch out and like Crobat thinking about possibly going for an earthquake, that's fine. I'm just gonna head smash because Flare Blitz won't kill and he will kill me with an earthquake. So I got to try to kill this thing. Man, I'm taking a long time to make these moves. Alright, so. Tapu Fini is 0 and 1. And Fernape is 1 and 1. He does withdraw. If he goes into Crobat, I'm happy. Danza. Crobat! Take a head smash! <laughs> Take a head smash, Crobat! 
Yes! And Embor, you sly dog, you! Took a lot of damage, that's fine. Took a lot of damage, and that's fine. But. Ugh, Crobat's gone. Oh my god, that's great. Oh my god, that makes me happy. That makes me happy Crobat's gone. Okay. Um, the Infernape's still a problem because he has that plus, gets that plus one. If I went for heads, uh, that Flare Blitz, I could have taken him out. And I still would have had him on top of Vinny. But I made that prediction that he would probably go for Earthquake or something. That's why I switched out. Now I expect him to go for Swords Dance, Poison DMZ. Like, what? <laughs> what? Um, Espeon is gone. So pretty much all he has is Infernape, Tangrowth, and Magiana. Now, at this range, can he live a head smash? I'm, it's reckless. Um, let me go back into Embor, Rusev. Um, what's that damn thing called? Deonsi? Not Deonsi. Um, Ma. Jina. Oh, yeah, he'll, he'll die. He'll die. He has to die. Oh, he lived. Wow. Shit. Did not expect him to live there. Okay, so he's he's Rocky Helmet Max Defensive. He's Rocky Helmet Max Defensive. Shit. <laughs> um. So. His base speed is 65. What is Deontay's base speed? 50. I gotta go into Velvet Sky here. I gotta go into Velvet Sky. He pretty, I think he pretty much won this at this point. Um, he pretty much won at this point. If he switches out an Infernape here, expecting him me to go for like a Giga Drain or something just to get damage off. Ha! <laughs> So, but Embor took out two of his biggest threats, so I'm happy. So I, I take out his Magiana. Magiana got two kills. Roserade. Because now he can go into Infernape now. And just take me out. So... I'm not going to let him try to set up a plus one, like a plus two sword stance up, so if he wants to just take me out, he can take me out, that's fine. Um, he might predict me to try to switch out. He might try to predict me to switch out, thinking, oh, he went for Hidden Power Fire, he can't touch this thing, let me switch out, let me go for a sword stance, he's switching out. Nope. <laughs> nope. Gonna go for the HP ground, just to get some damage off on this thing. Just to get damage off on this thing. Who knows, maybe I might be able to take him out. I don't know. Um, I forgot to switch the thing to Technician, I think. So, it won't do as much. If I was Technician, it probably would do a lot more. But I don't think I'm Technician on this thing. I, don't, I was going to switch it. Technician, I think I forgot. If he's not running max speed, then I'll, I should outspeed. But, why wouldn't he run a max speed? <laughs> why wouldn't he run max speed? Doesn't make any sense. That'll make no sense for him not to run max speed. So we're now just waiting. He goes for the close combat. Can I live it? No, damn it! I thought I could live it. Shit. <laughs> damn. Like, I was hoping I would be able to live that. If I lived that, oh my god, that would have been beautiful. It was going down so slow, so I really thought I was going to live that. Damn. Oh, well, that's fine. That's fine. So I'm just going to go for the Earth Power here. Because his defense plus defense are lowered. And I am bulky, so I might be able to live any hit that he throws my way. He goes for the close combat. I am part fairy, I'll live it. I do live it, and Earth Power, now that he's minus two, Earth Power should kill. 
Cool. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So, even if I lose here, I'm, I'm still happy um, that the game went really well. Because this thing is probably regenerated. Yeah, he has so much HP. I won't be able to take this thing out. Um, I'm just going to... I mean, he might be a physical defensive, but I'm assuming he's assault vested. So I'm just going to go for the power gem. Yeah, there's not much I can do there. So he won. He won. There's not much I can do here. So GG to him. GG to him. It was down to a 1-0. Again, I lost. <laughs> um, now I am 0-3. So I'm probably the worst battler in the league right now, but you know, whatever. I'm here. Um, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Yeah, there's, I, I can't take this thing out. <laughs> so I'm going to try, do my best just to take this thing out. Yep, nope, I go down. Um, so GG to him. It was a 1-0 victory in his favor. Um, that head smashing uh, t damn Tyrantrum in the beginning really screwed me over there because I lost my Raikou. Really nice to have had my Raikou around for this, but you know, whatever. If I'm predicting him to go for close combat and switch into Deontay, I might have been able to take him out and win the match. I could have come into Rosa Raid and taken him out, but hindsight 2020, there's not much I can do about that. Um, but GG to you, Uzi. Good team, good battle. And guys, make sure you go check him out in the description below. I'll leave his link down there. Go check him out. Go check out his side of the battle. Uh, go give him a subscribe button and all that type of stuff. But with that, I want to thank you all for watching this video, and we will see you next time. Peace.